Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video how you can transfer data from the internal storage to the micro SD card at the Samsung Galaxy A22 and A22 5G. Okay, for that we will need a file explorer and there's already one pre-installed here on the phone. So just swipe it up here so that you're in the app drawer and at the very first point you will see a Samsung folder with some Samsung apps in it. So tap it and here we will need the app My Files. So, yeah, first of all, you have a nice overview here in categories for images, videos, and audios, and so on. But we will need this point here, the internal storage. So, and here we have an overview with all our folders here on the phone. And uh, if you want to have a bit more space on your internal storage, I would recommend to you to transfer at first the photos and the videos you have done with your camera. And you will find them here at the DCIM folder. So tap on camera here again, so to the camera folder, and here you will see all the photos and videos you have done with your camera. So now go on the picture you want to remove, uh, to move, sorry, not to remove, to move in the, our case. So go on the picture you want to move and hold it until you see that it's marked. And if you want, you can now mark also some other pictures you want to transfer, or if you want to transfer everything, just go here to select them all. Tap, tap. So, and after you have the opportunity to copy these pictures and videos and so on for, for safety, but we want to have more space on the internal storage. So we go here on move to move them completely to another place. And yeah, then go back here with the arrow one more time so that you're back. So, so three times that you're back in the regular view here. And uh, we want to transfer them now to the SD card. So tap on SD card. So my SD card have already some folders. Maybe your SD card you have bought when you don't have uh, folders on um, the storage. Uh, then I would recommend to you to create a folder here with the three points. And go here and create folders. And then you have a better overview later that you have a folder for pictures and so on. So, but I have already folders here on my SD card, as you can see. So I created also a DCM folder here. So go on DCM camera. Okay. And if you are finally in the folder you want to have your pictures in, just go then here on move here. So then the phone will transfer the pictures from the internal storage to the uh, folder in your SD card. Okay. I think very nice. So let's go back here. By the way, you can also go here on the on the folder with the house on it to be in the uh, regular overview. And I want to show you something else again here, the internal storage, because you can do the same thing we did right now with files. You can do the same thing also with folders. You can mark the complete DCIM folder. Just go in the folder and hold it. And then the complete DCIM folder is marked. Same with documents and so on. But if you want to transfer completely uh, so some complete folders, I would recommend to you that you check first that there's no operating system data in it, like in the DCM uh, folder or the document folder or here the music folder, the download folder and so on, because you can just transfer uh, data like pictures, uh, videos, uh, audio files, some document files and so on. Okay, and then go here on move and same thing uh, as the files, um, transfer them to the SD card and finally. I want to show you something else because um, you don't want to do this all the time and so on. So uh, you can uh, also put your future camera pictures directly on the SD card without transferring and so on. So let me show you how this works. Uh, so if you go on the camera, and me is giving you the opportunity already right now to change the location directly to the SD card. If yes, just change the location to the SD card. If not, like in my case now, you can set it up here at the camera settings here at this place. So just tap on the simple for the settings here and then scroll a bit down and we will need this point here, the storage location. Yeah? Actually, in my phone, it's set it up that's the internal storage, no? so that my pictures and videos and so on go directly to the internal storage. But you can change it that it goes directly for the next time on the SD card. I would recommend this to you because that saves a lot of time. 
Yeah, thank you so so much for watching this video. I hope I could help you with it. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me something that would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so so much for. And yeah, I've created also some other videos if you're interested in may like to transfer um, some app data on the SD card, how this works and so on. And uh, yeah, if you want, you can also subscribe me. It would be really a pleasure to see you again. And yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao.